guys, Chauncey Phillips here from Panera Bread. This is going to be quick. What I'm getting here today is a smoked turkey, the half, for 220 calories, the chicken cob avocado salad for 290 calories, and the broccoli cheddar, which I may eat now, I may eat later for 200 calories. But I'll show you what I get at home. Also, I'm going to talk about some of the things here that are bad and what kind of things to avoid here when you come to Panera Bread. This place I've been coming to since I was probably like in the fifth grade or something like that, off and on. But, you know, you got to make, you know, change now, though, some of the things that you get. And definitely things to avoid no matter what here now. So I'm leaving Panera Bread with a sack of food. All right, so I'm back from Panera Bread, and I'll show you what I got. So I got the chicken avocado cob salad. That's $2.90, and that includes the um, dressing. As you see, though, it's a very small amount. So, like, don't go and be tempted to get, you know, more of it. Just make that amount work because, you know, when you add more of that, truthfully, with salad, all the really the calories of it that really add up are the dressing. So that's really what you want to watch out for, you know, because years, you know, recently before I, mean, I was trying to do so I was like, oh, yeah, you might need more than that. But you really don't. It really, that amount really does work. You might think that it isn't going to, but it really does. And I got is the pick two there, so then you get the turkey with it. And um, I just got the turkey one with this, I don't know what kind of mustard they put on this, but I said mustard because mustard is usually the better option of it because the mayonnaise is uh, usually where like a lot of the calories is. I also, they had these little packets in there I want to show too. If you want to say none of that, and you can put it on yourself there. They have um, these mayonnaise packets there, which are mayo with olive oil, which are not bad. And they're... Um, they're 40 cal 35 calories for this. So if you want to like limit it and get this and say nothing on it, that's an, a way to do it. And they also have this spicy brown mustard here. And these are usually like around five calories. Like mustard is usually really, really low. So usually not a lot of calories in that. Now here's one of the things they put in the bag. You know, definitely don't eat these. Don't get stirred up on, you know, because they're greasy and you just don't want to get stirred up on that. So these have been going in the trash lately. Um, the other thing, too, to watch out for is these rolls uh, that come with the soup. There are 180 calories, so depending on how many calories you, you know, can eat a day, I'm usually keeping it you know, on these papers like this, trying to figure everything out, and not eat more than 2,000 calories, which is what it says, because I'm also doing swimming, which I'll do, I'm going to do a video about that as well, but I got the small soup as well, which I may eat now or may just save for later, and that's uh, 200 calories. Uh, but like I said, you know, it's more if you eat the bread with it. The one thing that's, you know, good about Panera Bread is they have the half sizes of things. So if you really work at it, you can get uh, a couple different things within a pretty relatively range of calories. And most things in there range like, you know, the soups are like 150 calories to like three to 400. So you got to look out with the soups. I'm going to put below what some of the worst items are to look out for. I did that in the last video as well, things to look out for. Um, you know, of course, just don't get any of the desserts in there. Those are a lot of those. Some of those things are like 750 calories uh, for some of the bigger things. And some of those are really high. So those are the things too. I haven't eaten any of that kind of stuff in a month now. So just, you know, two people who are wanting to lose weight as well, to stay clear of that stuff. Don't even get started on eating it because once you eat it again, then you may be tempted to get it again. Just sort of stay clear of that. So anyway, though, guys, thanks for all the support of these new series of videos. Like I said, let me know below places you'd like to see me try. Um, and I know a lot of people say you can make stuff at home. and stuff. Like I, I, like I said, I'm going to do some of that. But I really do like going places. I like getting out and getting to places and making the smart decision. That's what this whole video series is about the okay things to get at these places and the things to not get. So anyway, though, thanks again for watching, for subscribing to the new channel, and don't forget to thumbs it up, and I'll see you guys later.